what you guys have done in the past? Um, I mean, we're preparing the same we do for every other game, and I mean, that's how it was when Coach Mendenhall was here. We did it his way, but really there's no difference between this game and the rest of the games this whole season. So we've had about a week off until we found out who we played, and uh, we lifted and helped everybody get healthy. And now that we know who we're playing, and we can scout them out. We're just doing what we've done all season long. What, what really jumps out to you about Wyoming? Or what, when you look at their, what they've done this season, with the athletes on the roster, what, what really stands out about that program? Well, they're, they're hardworking guys. They're tough, they're tough players. So it will be a good uh, team for us to play against. Um, I know they're hungry and, and ready for some recognition. Uh, they have a big bowl game here, so we're expecting them to come out and fight their hardest. So they, they've got one of the top running backs in the country. Yeah, BYU's had a really good run defense all year. Right. How do you guys look at that challenge ahead? Uh, we respect him. We respect uh, his stats and you know what he's done, but we're confident we can stop him. So we're gonna go out there and play as we have all season and just fly to the ball and make plays with, we'll have everybody making plays. So that's kind of the beauty of our defense right now is there's so many playmakers on the field that it's it's hard for one guy to, to kind of beat our defense. And so um, I respect him, I respect their team, but I'm confident in what we're going to do. You were bold in your November predictions. You got any prediction for this game? No, we're going to win again. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you the same thing forever. <laughs> <laughs> said your coaches have a lot of experience with Wyoming, Kalani, and Ty, and all those guys. Have they brought any of that up, or have you noticed them get a little bit excited for this game just because of the BYU and Wyoming history? Um, they haven't really brought it up that much. Today was our first day back practicing since uh, Utah State, so we haven't had much interaction with them, so uh, I'm sure there will be some as we practice more, but not yet. So you guys are kind of facing a multiple offense, like your guys' offenses. That change anything for you guys on defense at all? No. Um, our coaches do a good job of just scheming every team we play, whether we we uh, twist or move more or we play straight up. It just depends on the, the offensive scheme and what they're doing, and we'll play accordingly. So um, I think all of our players have kind of, at this point in the season, we've gotten good at everything they've asked us to do. And so we'll just go out and play the plays they call, and it's kind of in their hands as far as what we do. Bowl games are a little unique side just because of the amount of time between games. Mm -hmm. You've got finals stuck in there as well. What, what's the key over the next few weeks to, to be ready for a bowl game? Um, I think our coaches have done a great job of mapping out our practice schedule. So uh, we've started today, and we'll practice every day until the bowl game. And we can start out with lighter practices, get heavier, and then we have a lot of time to recover. And so with doing that and spreading it out that much, it allows us to practice less during finals so we can concentrate and take our tests, but at the same time be prepared. So it's kind of nice to have that time to get everybody healthy and feeling well and be nice at the games after finals and all that, not during finals. I think this is the first time in a couple of years we haven't conflicted with finals, so I think it will be a big load off everybody's shoulders going into this game. This is going to be your last game here at BYU. Do you have any personal goals that you want to happen during this game? I just want to—I want to leave it all on the field. Um, every single time I strap up to play a game, I—I I say my prayers that I'm going to be safe. But in my head, I, I, I'm hoping and doing everything I can to make that game the best game I've ever played. And so, as we go into this game, it's my last game as a college football player. The goal is the same: I got to make it the best game I've ever played. So, that's where we're at.